see, I'm coming at you from right here in my house, in my kitchen. And I've been teasing a lot of you guys lately on my blog, Facebook, um, sending out emails with my good old fancy, you've probably seen this nice little old school tomato jar. Look at this, made in Oklahoma, I think we got some tomatoes in this one. But you've probably seen my juices that I drink on a daily basis in this jar. And I've got a lot of inquiries and emails, what are you drinking? Some fans out there saying, hey, I've been juicing for years. Some people saying, what the heck is that? I can't believe you're drinking it. I'll be honest with you. Some people are really turned off with it. I bring it to work, and some of the guys out at work are like, oh, my gosh, don't even come near me with that. And I'm just chugging this thing. Now, let me preface, because today what I want to do for you is I want to give you a little education and background on why you should juice, number one. Number two, I want to show you a little of what I juice on a daily basis. Um, but I want to preface all that by telling you this. All right, I do think juicing is an acquired taste, and you know, in the initial stages, you might be turned off by it, especially if you don't get an adequate amount of nutrients, vitamins, and minerals from all your fruits and vegetables that you need to be getting on a daily basis. Now, I juice because, uh, to be honest with you, I was brought up juicing. My mom had me and my sister juicing when we were like five, six years old. She was feeding, I don't even know, maybe younger than that. She's probably watching this video and was feeding us juice, uh, you know, breast milk in one bottle, juice in another bottle. So I, I was just brought up on it. But I was actually inspired because the other day on my Facebook, some friends from out in New Jersey, they were telling me that they juice. And uh, one of our friends out there, Amy, she was actually telling me that she came down with cancer, started to juice, and her cancer's just gone in remission. She's doing great. But one of the reasons that she contributes to doing so well in her health is the juicing that she's been doing on a consistent basis, a regular basis for the last few years. And the cool thing is her husband's on board doing it and her kids. I think she has twin kids. I want to say, don't get mad at me, Amy. I think they're like 10 years old, but she's starting them young. So I want to encourage you, um, number one, the importance of juicing. A lot of people in the age we live in here in America, we do not get enough nutrients, vitamins, minerals, enzymes from the foods and all the processed crap that we eat on a daily basis. So for me, I feel very confident that me and my wife, that if we can get a juice in a day, that we're getting what we need, um, and we usually get one to two juices a day, that we need in the fast-paced life that most of us live in. So uh, I want to press that. Actually, you know what? Let me show you something real quick. Some days, I'm going to be honest with you, I don't have the time to get my juice in. I'm really busy. I'm traveling. So I can show you right here is a powder form of Barley Max, and this is about seven to eight um, of the servings of fruits and vegetables that you should be getting on a daily basis. And all this is just a powder. This one has extra um, fruit added to it. This is just straight barley mass. So you can mix it with all natural organic apple juice. You can mix it in water. I put it in my protein shakes. Um, and if you're interested in this, this is a very convenient way to get your servings of nutrients, minerals, and vitamins, and enzymes that you need on a daily basis. But a lot of people in the age we live in, most people are not getting what they need. So I'm going to show you what I do on a daily basis. I get a good old cucumber. I juice my cucumbers. I always juice my carrots, okay? And I don't even measure, I don't even know how many I use. I just juice until I have enough for right then, immediately what I'm going to drink right after. And then I store some in these glass containers. You don't want to keep your juice, and there's a lot of people out there that believe in keeping their juice for long periods of time. You lose a lot of the enzymes, you lose a, not a lot of the nutrients. Now listen, I'm not an expert on all the juicing, I'm not a, some professional on that, but my mom's very educated, and since we were very young, we've been educated on that. 12 hours max. If you keep it in glass jars like this, it will last longer in the freezer, okay? So I usually juice for that day, or if we juice at night, at night, we're juicing for the next morning, all right? So you don't want to lose the nutrients minerals. The other thing we put in there is we throw in a good old apple, you know, it makes it a little sweet. Um, we have our good old beets right here. I like the beets, and they're very nutrient for you. Right here, you can see I have a couple pieces of ginger that we throw in there. What else do we have? Good old celery probably goes in every juice we use. Celery. And then we have our <clears throat> awesome green leafy kale, which we put in. And sometimes I just throw the kale right in my protein shakes. If you don't have a juicer, and then, hold on, got the good old spinach at the bottom. So this is what I'm going to make today. Um, in this juice, and sometimes I don't have the time to juice. You know what? Some people don't have a juicer. Um, there's benefits behind a juicer and, and what it does with the fiber and the enzymes. And I'm using the old school juicer that I pulled out my old school Gary Null juicer. Okay? Uh, there are juicers that are better than others, all right? And I don't have time to go into all that, but one I highly recommend is the Champion juicer. We've been using that for years, and you're going to get the most benefit out of that. It's Champion juicer. 
by Green Star. If you're interested in that, contact me directly. I can get you uh, even possibly a discount on that. Uh, but you, typically, I just have my nice little handy cup here that the juice goes into and a strainer because my wife doesn't like all the pulp and all that stuff. I don't mind it. All right, so I'm gonna throw you, I'm just gonna give you a quick little demo how I juice, and I'm gonna talk to you a little more about how you can get started. Just nice and easy, nothing fancy. A lot of people think juice is real complicated. Just put your stuff in, nice and easy, and push it down nice and easy. Now, I'm not gonna sit here all day and juice for you, you're probably gonna get bored. But I will post, when I'm done, a good old, a good old picture with this video. So you can see what the juice turns out like. A little beet here. Nice little apple. And of course, my good old kale, which I put in every juice. Good. Now you can see I'm just getting started. But I want to show you how simple it is. The hardest part about all this is I'm telling you, clean the juicer. And most juicers are very simple to clean, but the hardest part is the cleaning up. But I want to tell you today, and I get a lot of questions and inquiries about organic versus non-organic. And I'm not, I am not—I don't want to elaborate on too much in this video, but I want to tell you, for me personally, <clears throat> my belief on that is something that has a skin on it, I'm not real, real picky on, all right? So like oranges, grapefruits, um, cucumber, if I'm skinning it off, if I'm peeling it, I'm not real picky on making it all organic. My celery, all organic. My spinach, all organic. My apples, all organic if you're leaving the skin on them. Uh, what else? Kale, all, all organic. Uh, carrots, all organic. But again, my fruits and veggies. If it's something like a banana that I'm going to peel and throw in a protein shake or eat, I'm not real picky about making it all organic. I think uh, some of it's overrated. Um, there's a lot of things. Oh, that's a whole other video, but I get a lot of questions on that. So I want to tell you, one of the books, I want to give you something today to show you what you can get started on. One of the books that got me inspired, besides my mom, of course, pushing us at a young age for us, and the ultimate health benefits, if you go and Google the benefits of juicing, a great uh, resource and website Hallelujah, Hallelujah Acres. Um, they do a lot of juicing and they, they claim to help a lot of people with diseases and different uh, health issues. But this is one of the books that really helped me kind of, uh, my foundation education um, and what I believe in. It's called the 80-10-10 Diet. It talks about 80% of your diet on a daily basis, your dietary needs, should come from raw whole foods. Awesome book, Balancing Your Health, Your Weight, and Your Life, Dr. Douglas and Graham. I encourage you to pick it up if you're interested in juicing. Again, it's not real complicated. Um, I just want to encourage you to get started somewhere. If you can't, if you don't have a juicer, you, you don't have access to it right now, you know what? Get the power form of Barley Max and Greens Plus and all these different ones that you can get on the market um, and start right there. But I want to encourage you to power juicing. Get on Google. Google the benefits of juicing. Again, I don't have the time to tell you all, tell you all about it. But it's something that has actually changed my life, changed my family's life. And now i got my wife on board. I'm excited. She's kind of addicted to juicing. There's nights I don't feel like juicing. And it's date night. It's Friday, 5.30. I want to go out and she wants a juice. No, don't, don't hit her up. I'm just joking there. She'd rather be take her out on a candlelight dinner. But anyway, this is Coach JC coming at you again. Get your life to the next level by starting to juice. I love you guys. I look forward to hearing from you. Hit me up if you have any questions, if you want to talk about the juicers I use, if you want to talk about the powder forms, or you need more information on that book. I'll post that all below. Love you guys. Coach JC here. CoachJC.com. Talk. To you.